Oh, hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to a game called Hydroneer. There's a new button on the map. Do you see it right here called Creative Mode? There's also this one that resets the Creative Mode and it allows us to go do very interesting and fun things like shoplifting for free. Also, there's this button, Creative Wand. It just makes me like spawn things. <laughs> oh yes, this will be very satisfying. There's also this thing, which is called the Gravity Tool where we can grab something and then just yeet it into space. Oh yeah. Like creating this beautiful levitating UFO. Whoa! <laughs> oh my. Now I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do in this video. You guys probably know more than I do since you already saw the thumbnail in the title, and that's very satisfying. Whoa! <laughs> that would be so deadly if someone here was with me to play with me, but I don't even have legs. So we might as well do what we do best: try to break the truck by dropping it into weird structures and then driving it somehow. So there's one thing. The first thing you always think of when you want something for free. Yes, you're like, oh, I'm gonna come up here to Hobson's Powerhouse because they have straight up nuclear bombs for sale. And by sale, I mean, since it's creative mode, <laughs> it's just it's just mine. Yep, beep beep, I'm a Jeep. Ooh, there's an easier path to go down. Let's do that real quick. Yes, gently drive through here, little truck. Nothing bad will ever happen to you. Oh, balls, this is gonna be bad. Oh, never mind. I think we, we got stuck in a cemetery. That's fitting. You know, we could just normally carry it there, but something about spawning it every about four feet all the way to my new base sounds like a better idea. We'll just bring a few of them right over in here into the truck depot, and then break out the trusty rusty auto clicker to spawn in a whole bunch of them. That should be a satisfying number of nukes, so many that I'm actually stuck in them. And they're also spewed all across the world in satisfyingly different directions. So I'll just bring my friends all the way with me back to the claim. And then I'll recognize that is the wrong claim because I took a wrong turn over here. So we'll bring them on a nice stroll through the forest all the way to the other claim, where I'll break out the auto clicker and have a bunch more fun for the next 10 minutes. Not exactly sure if this is enough nukes, but I think it might work for maybe a first round. Also, they're just being thrown everywhere. <laughs> Look at that one. Go. Oh, that's satisfying. There's just nukes literally spread everywhere on this map, and I didn't even place most of them down manually. They just decided to show up there. Much like children showing up at my house on Halloween asking for free candy. Why doesn't a kid ever show up in my house in like June and be like, hey, give me 20 bucks and I'll mow your lawn? That would be a much better deal than showing up and saying, hey, give me free candy or else I'm gonna throw eggs at your house later tonight. Oh, Halloween 2018, you didn't disappoint one bit. At least I got free omelets. So now the question is, which nuke gets to be selected as the first explosion? I guess it's you because you were the one I chose. And oh boy, this is, you know what? Let's, uh, let's do one of those real quick. We'll just save the game because more than likely it's gonna crash. Oh, balls, that was satisfying. My ears thank me. Oh yes, wow. <laughs> the world has ended. It, it, it wasn't me this time. I promise I didn't do it. What is going on? Yeah, <laughs> there it goes. Oh, oh yeah, that's nice. Oh, it didn't go this way. What? It didn't go through my forest adventure? Why are there so many nukes left? So second attempt. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, <laughs> just running through the nukes. Wait, it didn't go back to town again? These nukes have terrible chain reaction properties, but they still look really cool. We also didn't hit the water at the bottom of this map, so I guess it's time to spawn a bunch more in. It's always a good sign when your computer mostly freezes and the sound effects coming from it sound like things are breaking. Oh yeah, it's quite leggy too. That's really good. Although it doesn't really look like that many nukes, I think it'll still be an explosive adventure. I just need to go through the slides of this PowerPoint presentation all the way back to buy another Switch. I also use that term buy a little bit loosely. I totally mean shoplift. And we'll do the thing where we save the game again because it might crash and then we'll go boop. Oh yes, oh no, I mean, uh, we did it. <laughs> I hear explosions, screenshot. Oh, we, we're doing it, everything's, everything's working. Am I alive? I'm alive. I'm, somehow I am alive. And we still didn't make it down to the water. Oh yay, nuclear blast. I think this is the remnants of my magic wand. I don't know where it went. Something satisfying about little tiny piles of nukes going boom boom. Oh, I hear water now. Yay, I have finally done it. That is satisfying, burning levels of fallout. Oh yes, let me in there so I can splash and play. So why don't we try this long one again? Kinda, hopefully it works. Oh yeah, it's working. It's kind of working, I can't see anything. 
Oh, yes, we have lots more explosions. Things are still exploding. Oh, it went that way. <laughs> Wait, is that the way it's supposed to go? I don't even know what's right and left anymore. We just have nukes going everywhere. Oh, no, the world's exploding. And the game's like, ah, uh, there's too many of them. Oh, there's the fire. The fire's coming. <laughs> and it looks like we did blow up the village, but evidently it's nuke proof. That sucks. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> Yay! Science! So I just need to steal a few items. Thank you, game, for legging out like that. I need you, and we need one of you, and one of you. Let's throw in one of these things, and some pipes, and some conveyors. Because we have magic to create. It's got to magically traverse our way through the leftover nukes that were here, and then fall down deep into the hole. That was nice. And after a brief bit of hocus pocus, we'll have a very nice machine. So using my infinite big brain skills, I just recognized that I bought the wrong sort of power. I mean, by buy, I mean, I totally shoplifted it. I need to buy power junk rather than regular junk. Reactor, there we go. We have power magnets. We have batteries and trash. There's elbows, straight lines. Yes, huh? I need all, no, shut up. I need this. The game's like, hi, huh? you want to steal it? And I'm like, yes, yes, I'm going to. Thank you very much. There's also something called a destroyer which is kind of cool. I don't think I need anything else, so I'm just going to shoplift that. So then I'm going to go off-roading through the forest that's filled with miscellaneous nuclear bombs. Hopefully none of them explode. Oh, no. Okay, it's fine. They're, they're, uh, they were duds. All of them. Yeah, unstuck. Perfect. I made it. And our little machine is, I mean, it's pretty little. I could have been bigger, but I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of lazy. Being a little bit lazy right now. So we're gonna have to do what we do best, and that is deleting things. And that means delete a lot of things. Okay, well, here it is. Uh, got a, a little bit, little bit larger than I thought it would. But I mean, when you have creative mode, you just kind of create, right? So what happens is that it goes through here. Hopefully, I mean, this is theoretical. I haven't actually turned it on yet, and it looks like I am missing some parts, but you turn it on, all of these things work. They grind up, they go into here, and then they go to the top where I'm going to make lots and lots of large stonks. We use nukes to make lots of money. Oh, did you see that jump? That was satisfying. All right, so I just need to hook this up and then throw in a little water to here, not to there, to here, and... Oh yeah, we don't have any <laughs> we don't have any shards in there. <laughs> How do I get shards? How do I get shards? I get shards from sharding. Which needs I which means I need to grab my shovel. Wait. Which means I need to grab my shovel, throw the dirt in the bucket, huh? take this dirt, throw it down, and then scoopy, scoopy, scrapey, scrapey. That was one chunk of gold. That is not what I'm looking for. Maybe one of these times I'm gonna get myself a big giny blue shard huh? out of here. And to da shard. No, it's not a shard. This uh -huh. is annoying. So, so annoying. This is annoying. Uh -huh. So, so annoying. Do you like my song? I just made it up. It also gave me a big brain idea. I know they don't come around very much, but woo! That was some fun. I wonder if I can use the magic wand to get free ore? Because, I mean, if I can duplicate. Oh, is that what we're looking for? Hey, hey you. Ha ha! A shard. If I can duplicate that stuff, it means I'm going to be a multi-bajillionaire and I don't even have to do anything. Okay, close it up. Please work. Oh, it's working. It's working. I'm like a young Anakin Skywalker. All right. If I turn you fellas on. Oh, it's grinding. It's, it's grinding my gears. Okay, if you're going to work, it could work. I wonder how far this actually goes. Oh, it's so slow. Okay, I need to, you know what? Let's shut it off. I got to turn everything on. I also want to make sure we have power all the way up here. It looks like we do. Yeah, it's all powered up. That's awesome. All right, so we'll switch these on. It does look like we do have power and they are working. So that's awesome. We'll just turn on all of these Goliaths and then cross our fingers to make sure we actually hooked everything up correctly. It is rolling. Money is rolling down. That's cool. Let's run over here real quick. Okay, we got pebbles coming in. Pebbles are going to start going up. Yes, on both sides. Are these things on? Oh, they're on. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's making infinite money. Drop down. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. So many money's coming out of it. 
I just hope it's this constantly for the next, like, hour. And then that gigantic spree of money going up there is gonna make us fabulously rich. Ooh, things are flying everywhere. I love it. Whee! <laughs> uh, I better put a, uh oh, I better put a, a thingy on the outside. I don't know what it's called, but a thingy where we can block stuff, like a fence. That's the word I'm looking for. Oh yes, so much money. All right, if I just do this like a whole buttload of times, we can just make an infinite stack of these things all the way to the moon. We're gonna get diamond hands. So we need to build up a big shard of shiny stuff. And no joke, this is this is literally like four minutes and we already have this much stuff, but it keeps running out of power. So I'm gonna try it. I don't know if it'll work, but I'm gonna try to duplicate that. Oh, balls. <laughs> We're gonna be rich because I can just duplicate all the money in the world. Oh, dirty McGurdy. Yes. So if I just put this bar in, we will never run out of power because I kind of glitched the system and magic. Nice, it's working. We have so much money coming in now. Now I think if my brain is large, which I, I can't prove that either way, if I start this with gold and then just move that right into here, um, not right there, <laughs> somewhere else in this general location. Oh yeah, <laughs> maybe it'll eventually start melting. Uh huh. I don't know what's happening. Oh, I, I hear noises. Oh my word, there is so much going on. I can't keep up with it. <laughs> There's so much gold going in. <laughs> I mean, it's it's kind of, oh yeah, we got it. We got it, sort of. Why, mm -hmm. oh, ball. Okay, ready, and then that one? Is that where I'm supposed to have this at? Okay, so are they, are they flushing properly? Uh, no, they're not. <laughs> That's okay. And uh, there it is. <laughs> it was almost buried under there. <laughs> So now that a gigantic pile of money is flashing before my eyes, I really need to get in here and try to get my, my thingy back. Um, I don't know where it is. <laughs> I, I need it though for, uh, for, I mean, I gotta pay for my kid's college. Ooh, something just fused in there, did you hear that? I don't think this is gonna work very well. So I probably just need to shoplift another one. You know, I just realized, I mean, I recognized it beforehand, but the giant pile of money is just humorous. The better thing is that I can straight up duplicate it. So I take this little amount of money and I flip it out and then I take this thing and duplicate the gold bar and then I put this in here and this in here and then I flip it. Then I accidentally grab a floor tile, but I'm incompetent. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Oh. How do I get this flat again? Okay, thank you. And then we duplicate that and then I make another one and I click on the thing and I do this. And every single time I do this, my money doubles. And pretty soon, a $1 million bar. Oh, did I just, oh, 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 dirty McGurdy. I didn't even think of this through this was accidental. Hey bud, can you melt? Thank you. It feels like such a waste because that pile of money is so funny. But then if I just click this button, it's like, hey, we just made $100,000. I just love driving over that hill and seeing the gigantic pile of money. Oh, oh, the money is backing up. That's actually kind of neat. Also the game crashed, so that's also not kind of neat, but kind of neat in the same vein. So I need this. Wait a second. I already bought one. Hold up. My brain's broken right now. I don't need that. I need this though. Totally have to make sure we don't lose our magic pokey stick. And since it's creative mode, we have to fix everything. Just kidding, that's just a really annoying feature in the game. Just kinda wanna see what happens if I poke this with a magical boomy stick. Oh, that's not actually that bad. Okay, I thought the game was gonna crash, but whoa, <laughs> that was cool. That was amazing. Oh yeah, the game does not like, oh, oh my computer's crying. Okay, I need to get a, I need to get a real big, oh balls, this is bad. Ready to get set, big scoop. Oh yeah, oh look at it, pulse. Oh, that was not good. Okay. Huh? huh? <laughs> Even the character's like, what the crap are you doing, man? That's really annoying. Oh, this was a bad idea. This was really not a great plan. Oh, the game's crying. Quick, <laughs> save the game. And fingers crossed that it's working properly. It is very good for us. Now the real question is, how much is this bar of gold worth? And if it's a million, that's too little. It's it's worth 159 bucks. <laughs> For real game? <laughs> You're gonna do that? You're gonna, we're gonna do that right now? $159? It might well just scoop up a handful of this and just throw it in the old machine right here. Glurp! Didn't really work as I wanted it to, but at this point, I don't really care because I'm creating a super metal 
Yes, get in there, my precious. And now that $159 bar of soap is... Oh yeah, 3,400. So if I take this, oh my word, is it laggy. And I start cloning it. Oh, that didn't work. And as I was saying, I start cloning it. That $3,000 bar of soap turns into a much bigger bar of soap. 120,000. And we break out the trusty, rusty auto clicker. We only get 589,000. So it's time to duplicate even more. Which turns into, oh, negative numbers <laughs> okay i want my negative numbers to become bigger negative numbers until the game is exactly like uh bro it's broken so we'll click on there Ooh, that was a nice satisfying drop in i'm really just curious what happens when you keep breaking the game like this oh that's that's the maximum or what's that bottom number say is that the weight one five three eight nine eight it just keeps going and going and going so evidently my game's like dude Please stop making big numbers go negative because, well, it, it's it's constantly crashing now. Uh, also, we have this might be one of the reasons why it's crashing. Mount, uh, Mount Wanahakalugi. That's what I'm going to name it. All right. And then everyone down. Oh, there. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, look at look at everything just flying everywhere. Oh, no. Oh, that's the wrong button. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Back in, back in, back in. Back, you got this. Uh -huh. and, oh, nope, that's the wrong button again. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. And then, and then, just, yeah, there it is. <laughs> We're sending those, you know what? I had a really bad idea that I should drop a nuke in here and make it go boomy. <laughs> We're gonna drop a nuke in there and go boom. After I make like a billion, a bunch million dollars. Okay, how much was this one again? And then, and then, and then, and then, So I place that on the ground and I go bop, 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 bop. And then every time I do it, it makes the money go even bigger, which is obvious because I probably have shown four minutes of me doing this. Oh, balls. I just wonder if like that is the maximum I can make. Would you, why are you backwards now? Game. No, no, we have, we have two million pounds of gold. Don't worry. I lifted today. It was leg day. Ooh, ah, ooh, ah. It was leg day. I have lifted, bro. I really wonder what 2 million pounds of gold in real life is, because the money is totally broken. I also want to just find a, a little tiny gem somewhere. There, there we go. I found a little tiny gem. And then I'll come over here and go, bop. <laughs> okay, and then if I, did I buy an an, I didn't, I didn't buy an anvil. Are you kidding me right meow? We'll slap that down and then we'll try to find the ring. I'm gonna make a ring. It sounds like a good idea. Okay, we have to do this. It has to be hot though. So I'm gonna move this over here. And then we have our beautiful little gemstone. They add like zero money. So we're gonna put that like, I'm gonna try to just like right there. Okay, get the ring. Now this should come out super hot, super. No, 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 get in, get in the, oh my word, it's so leggy. Get in the hole and then go boop and then go boop and then go right on here and then grab a hammer. Oh, oh I can't, I can't with the leg. Give me the hammer, give me the hammer, give me the hammer, give me the hammer. And shoop, packer. I have to be faster, but it's hard with two FPS. Okay, on there and then drop it like it's hot. Don't worry, it only weighs a million pounds. And, oh, you're kidding me, stop this. Would you stop being, you're, you're being annoying right now. I'm trying to make a video. No! That was not the right button. It's always fun in games till you drop a two million pound block of gold on the ground. Uh-huh. Tell me again how you want to be there. Thank you. All right, maybe if I move you right here, maybe accidentally it'll fall right on top on purpose. I probably could have gone to the grocery store and bought another furnace before this works. No, it didn't work but I can place it on here, then I can grab the hammer, and bingo! Really, game? Not like this. Why do you do this to me today? It's getting even more slideshowy. This is amazing. Get in there, quick, get cooked. <laughs> A gigantic 10 foot tall pile of money. All right, you good now? You good? Not really, I can't move. Drop it, like it's, no, 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 no. Okay, where's the blacksmith hammer? There it is. Oh, we're going to make the most speckless and speckless necklace ever. Really? I didn't even make it. I didn't even make a necklace. I just made an armband. Oh, that is stupid. I'm going to put it right there. Uh-huh. 
And then we're gonna play with these things. I love how the game just doesn't know what's going on right now. Don't worry, you'll find out very soon. And we'll hook up the button right here. And then, <laughs> then I'm gonna click it. This is really a bad idea, but I'm perfect at bad ideas. Here we go, bum! I should have saved it. I should have saved it before I blew it up. Oh no, my poor game. Is it gonna work? Um. Whoops, as one might expect. Uh, game, game kind of. Whoa! <laughs> it came out of it somehow. What just happened? Okay. I mean, I'm alive, sort of. This might have, this might have made everything even more worser. Um, I don't, I don't have any idea what's happening. Welcome to Microsoft Windows. Slideshow Explorer 2021, where I'm hopefully gonna go back to the main menu and everything will be better when I load the game. It's loading. Oh, <laughs> where, did, where did all the money go? <laughs> Wait, that's most of it. Except we just have a nice like nuke sized chunk taken out of it and it filled in with all of the little shards of happiness down below. Oh my word, look at all of that. So let's see how much this little necklace thing makes at the grocery store. I'm gonna put that down. Oh, I see large numbers. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> negative, ne what is that? We have the, the hundreds and then the negative $10,737,418. I don't know how that works, but, oh. No, I don't have anything for it. Makes me sad. So that's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Keep your stick on the ice. Bye. I'd also like to thank all of the channel members and Patreon supporters, including Alan H, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Ben, Dickie J, Teddy Epius, Desby, Eagle Ark, Maxer, Whip It Good, Baron Fox, Zarnoff, Deegan, Jason M. Rail, Splatter Sacks, Iffy Spear, Joe B, Obi John Kenobi, Fury Arrow, and Doug Rules 2.0.